A man helped fix someone's car wheel, but when he saw what was inside, the man cried. Today's story is about David Magner, who recently posted on his Facebook page about his impressive story concerning another man on the road. His post says, I took this picture of my bloody hand yesterday while I was going on a trip to spend time with my family. When I was driving down the highway that led to Arizona, I saw an old minivan stop by the side of the road. I tried to go forward, but something told me to go back and see if they needed help. So I stopped the car and went to check on him. I found a man trying to change a tire, and I asked him if he needed help. He told me he no longer had a spare and didn't know what to do. I told him to call a tow truck, but he said he had no money. At that moment, I said to him, I have a spare tire, I can give it to you. He was glad to take it, and I helped put him on. While I was fixing it, I noticed inside the vehicle there were women, two small children. One of them was saying I'm hungry, and I felt sorry for him. The man said he'd lost his job, so he took his family to travel to New Mexico, where his relatives are, hoping they would fix him up until he could change his situation. Seeing those little children starving made me want to cry. While putting on the spare tire, I scratched my hand, but it didn't matter. Everything was worth it. I realized the man felt ashamed because I helped him without asking for anything in return. However, I couldn't fix the tire properly. We went a bit further down the road to find the garage, and there the employees quickly fixed the damaged wheel. The couple was somewhat concerned because fixing the tire was expensive and their money, what little they had, would run out fast. So I asked to speak privately with the owner of the tire company without them noticing. I told him I wanted to pay for the tire repair and want to buy a new one to serve as a replacement. I also told the family story. Manager just smiled and said, don't worry, there's not going to be any charge. Everything will be free. The family didn't know. I just grabbed my spare and said goodbye and saw the joy on their faces. The man, his wife, and children were very kind. I know I wasted my time for two hours and even, you know, ended up scratching my hand, but you don't know how good it felt to help an unknown sad family, David said. It's good to know that there are still good people out there who'd give unconditional help. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you won't miss our latest uploads.